So, I'm not sure what to do next. I don't really think it matters. It seems like you're going to have to do these missions no matter what. Look at this. Corporate oppression will only end once you stop oppressing yourself. Who, what is this Bart Moss collective messages I keep getting? <laughs> Fucking cryptic shit. So, first of all, um, man. I either want to up my intelligence or my reflexes because these would have allowed me to do more dialogue options that I couldn't do up to this point. So I think I'm going to do reflexes up. Okay, I have two perk points available. Um, it just doesn't seem like clear what you should be doing, honestly. Allows you to craft rare items. All right, I got that. Now I can craft rare items. Oh, boy. I'm going to to my own grenades. Uh, bullet jock. Increases damage with uh, rifles and submachine guns. I don't know. I really don't know what to do. There's so many options that it becomes almost a moot point. Like, there's so much to do, you don't know what, what's good, right? There's so many upgrade options. <clears throat> I already got this. Health regenerates during combat. Here, increase my carry capacity by 60. I, I just don't. I don't care. Honestly, there's too many options that I just don't. It, this is the thing, like, in a game where all these options are immediately available to you, and you have no idea what's good, you just don't care anymore. I'm just going to throw it into anything, you know? I think that this game, what they should have done is had direct skill trees that were more concise. Like, for example, Assassin's Creed uh, Valhalla I'm playing right now. And even though it has a giant skill tree, there's only a few paths you can take at a time. So you just pick the best ones out of those paths, and eventually they'll lead you to better things. Here it's like, here's 17 options in one tree that you can do, and there's five trees. So, you want me to look through 60, 70 options every time I level up and think I'm going to pick the best one? Of course not. I actually think that this is, it's too complicated. They should have simplified this, in my opinion. It's very, very overcomplicated. Um, well, we already talked to him, to Johnny. So, that's now, you know, that mission is over with, I guess, it completed. So, now we got to go to Jig Jig Street, I guess. Um... <laughs> Lies of her soul, I don't care about missing out on anything because the nudity is off. It's nothing that I'm interested in, nor I would want to see. So, I'm happy that I have it off, actually. Alright, um... So, we need to go to Jig Jig Street, which apparently is right around the corner. Okay. <clears throat> I now have... Uh, just under 4,000 credits. Which is funny, because I had zero, so I, I did earn some credits. <clears throat> just for doing these story missions. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, um... I guess I should re-equip my better weapons, because I'm pretty sure these suck. Like... 250 DPS handgun. I'll equip that. And... Uh, let's see here. This is... 131. This is 135. I definitely want a shotgun. So I'll equip the shotgun, the tactician shotgun, and one thirty-five, and I guess we'll equip that. And everything else is junk. Like everything else I could disassemble or sell. Shout out to the pastryarchy who just resold for three years. Thank you for three years of support, pastryarchy. He says the worst glitch you've seen so far in your playthrough. Go in this playthrough. Um. The, the, the uh, characters flying. Like, there was one scene, which I didn't even realize it was a bug at first. I was standing on a, on a balcony, and two characters flew through the air at hyperspeed by me. And then when I went to an elevator later on, there was an enemy that was in that elevator you needed to take out. There was an item on him you needed. And he kept teleporting out of the elevator like the Flash and then appearing again. It was pretty jarringly bad. Um, Robert Wilson. Hey, there you hey. go. Loud and clear, you don't need to yell. What's up? Who's this? Doing a little competition. Shoot, prizes and all. You know, over here with the range. The shooting range. <laughs> yeah, that it makes sense. Well, you in? A contest not really your style. 
I didn't think big parties were your thing. Yeah, well, it ain't a big one, but, you know, running low on heads. I bring in the clients. It's a trap and shit. Good try selling iron straight from the factory. Skip the whole part where you tinker for hours on each little shooter. Vinny, my dignity, please. Sure, I'm in. I'm not doing it when? now, but I'll at least accept well, this and uh, I can do it later. Right now. We'll wait on you. See ya. Molly will be waiting a long time because I'm not doing that right now. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, Turtle just like, saw a car fall from the sky. I'm not shocked. I'm not shocked at all. It seems like all the all the major bugs are crazy physics bugs. For me, alright, the most annoying glitch in the game is that it doesn't save my settings. Every time I go to play it, where the game crashes, the fucking settings are gone. I have to redo them again and again and again. That shit is super annoying. Name another game I played in the last 10 years that wouldn't save my fucking settings in the menu, right? It's, it's a really amateur night kind of glitch that they probably could fix easily. They just haven't yet. Is this a jump disassembler? Or, uh, can I sell shit here? Yes. Sell. Sell. I have to click it twice. Here, sell all this shit. Okay, here we go. This claims it's more powerful. Oh, it's, just, it's more powerful than the shotgun. Well, I already have an assault rifle, so. Okay. So, I don't want any of these melee weapons. Now, the katana is quite good. If you look at it, it's worth 200. Maybe I'll keep the katana just to have one melee weapon if I ever need one, like by necessity, like I run out of ammo completely. Oh shit, I got a bunch of sh uh, armor and stuff I could take a look at and see if it's any better, right? Shout out to Long Dong Silver, who tipped me a dollar. <laughs> Thanks, Long Dong. I appreciate that, really. And then, the Pastriarchy just tipped me $16. Says, don't want to get spoiled, so I leave you with this. Thank you, Pastriarchy. Yes, if I'm ahead of you, I strongly recommend that you do not stick around because you will be spoiled. Um, Because I am doing story right now. Uh, but thank you for the support, the resub, and the tip. And that means that we have hit the $50 tip skull for today. And that means I can put uh, <clears throat> put on the gunner glasses. Harley Quinn asked, how many crashes have I had? The first 10 hours, I believe I had four. And today I had one. So that would be five in about 12 hours, 13 hours of gameplay. Every, I guess you get one crash per two hours of gameplay. There you go. Okay, so let's see. Do I have any... Uh, new armor or anything that I would want to wear. Nothing there. No. Wait, does it have an icon? Maybe it does. Yeah, it has an icon when you have something new. Trousers? The trousers are better. What are they? Old banana juice neotac pants. Old banana juice. What the fuck? Alright, we can sell everything else. So, what's not equipped? This isn't. And these shitty shoes. Everything else is equipped? The bandages are only worth $28, so that's not worth it. Oh my god. Look at all this. Am I ever even going to use these? I got a piece of pizza. <laughs> a disgusting piece of pizza. What? Is, oh my god, a hot dog. Actually, it's called a hot dog. Who would even do eat this? It's not even needed in the game, right? Like, <laughs> I don't know what's going on in this game. You just grab so many items. Like, what am I, What is this? Is this my stash? No, this is like all the items that are equipped, I guess. Okay. All right, so I guess we're good for now. All right. I have about 5,000 in in-game currency now. Shout out to Bubble Buddy who cheers. You take care, buddy. Slap Keanu Reeves' legs for me. Enhanced Biscuit Mode Cheers is doing a blade-based stealthy Korean chick for my playthrough. The, pl the playstyle is exhilarating. Yeah, see, I'm, I haven't done any melee combat because it's so primitive. See, I feel like I'm playing Skyrim again. So that's why I haven't really messed with it. Billy the Carpet Smear has now subscribed. What a name. All right. This is Jig Jig Street, huh? 
Keanu just fucking loaded. Takamura is saying something. What is this? Can you talk? It is important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. Okay. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Get to the point. Old friend, <laughs> well connected to the influential. Why so mysterious? Get to the point. I told you once I would explore options, knock on many doors. There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Konpiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. All right. Fine. Where's the meat and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. Japan Town. You there. So that's a completely different area, I get the feeling. All right. We'll do this mission first, though, since we're here. We just drove here. CM Fool to be $1.30 says, not to make an excuse for the game, but everyone is the Terminator. I mean, yeah, everyone is. In the game, everyone is a fucking cyborg, so that's why they all absorb the bullets and shit. But it doesn't necessarily make for a very effective combat system. Every time there's gunplay, it doesn't, it doesn't feel fun, honestly. It's just kind of like, shoot till they go down. Just like Borderlands is the same way. At night, from the den located after the fifth bamboo on the hamlet, the fox goes out to hunt. He quenches his thirst at the watering hole while waiting for your arrival. He takes shelter in the shade of cherry blossoms. The fox is cautious and shall emerge when his shirt... Boy, this guy is weird. Takamura? Amateur Merc. Yes, this is Takamura. I'm using a burner via secure connection. I figured it would be best to use the secret code I created. I suspect it might be beyond your abilities. Maybe at the docks at Channel Street, Japantown. Come at night. If no one has followed you, I will show myself. Trust this was understood. Not too complicated. I got it, Goro. See you. Okay. Anyway, let's do the mission we're going to do here. Zero Gaming just says... Uh, how's the game so far? How, how far in am I? I'm in Act 2. We did the first major story mission of Act 2. And now we're heading to another one. So we're not super far into the game yet, but we are doing story-based stuff today. What does Keanu have to say? So this more up your alley than clouds. Hey, at least here you know what you get. Wow. Oh my god, this game. You gotta be kidding me. Well, that's crash number two for today. <laughs> crash number two. Oh man. Now you know what's gonna happen? It's gonna delete all my it's gonna delete all of my settings. So everything that I saved is gone again. And now when I boot the game, I have to set all the settings again. Because it it deletes them when that crashes. Oh my god, this game is is fucking terrible. It's seriously bad. Like, what the fuck did they do to this game? They thought this was ready to sell. Ay, ay, ay. <sighs> this is the power of PS5. No, PS5, until this game... I had I only got one crash ever on PS5. I can't even remember what, what it was. Though that past month playing games on PS5 has been outstanding. It's not the PS5 that's the fucking problem. It's the makers of the game. They're the problem. According to this, my settings are still on. But what happens when I continue now? Let's find out. <laughs> Good lord. Good lord. Do the speech? What speech? What speech should I be doing, hey there, Elon Musk? Beautiful butterflies that the game has too many side quests. Most of them are generic. From what I'm seeing, I think you're right. I think there are a few that are kind of unique, but for the most part, yeah, everything I've done it ended up being pretty generic. So this more up your alley than clouds. Do this again. Hey, at least here you know what you get. Here we go again. Jacked and coat. Here, kitty, kitty, what's the rush? Free, fuck off! 
Yeah, gear looks a little basic, but it works. So he didn't ask for any money? Over here. Not even Okay. Fingers MD. It's a different dock, or I guess they call him Ripper, right? Hey, not one step closer. Here to see who. Don't start. Got an issue. Need sword now. Here to do that. So how about you fuck off? Let me through, <laughs> and no one will be the wiser. So serious from the get go. I was only joking. Sheesh. Fine. <laughs> Let him through, Sludge. I had a high enough stat to get him out of my way. See him fool to me another dollar thirty. He says, "What does Elder Scrolls Six have to do to top this game? Work. <laughs> War, just work. All it has to do is work, and it's already going to be better. So there you go. Hey, hands off! I think I'm scared of your skinny ass. You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. What is going on? claim. Take it to court. Pussy. And leave me be. Fine, I get it. Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you want. Made it all the way here, huh? What the fuck? I must really want to talk to Evelyn. Look who it is. How did Hello? Judy end up here? There's a line. Nah, -uh, you ain't cutting. Yeah, Sit what are you doing here? What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you, looking for Evelyn. You knew she wasn't at Clouds? I need to say, this whole time, you knew Evelyn wasn't at Clouds. Who do you take me for? Why would I lie about something like that? Because you don't trust me. <laughs> You're right, I don't. But that doesn't make me a liar. Streaky, the Mox got fingers in their crosshairs. Mox don't happen to have fingers in their crosshairs. No, why? Heard Joy Toys come out of his clinic in worse shape than they come in. Yeah, well, can't solve all the world's problems at once. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front. Why me? <laughs> I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. Uh, okay. I'm supposed to scan them to know who they are. No, that doesn't tell you. They won't let me. They won't let me talk to them. What the fuck. Oh, I need to sit. Fingers a friend to the working guys and girls around here? Helps me. I'd be in a wheelchair if it wasn't for him. He chipped you some chrome with real skin that had peeled off. What he replaced it with looks like a bathroom floor from a senior home. <laughs> Better than being a cripple. Wait, final wait. You could pay. Find yourself a bit of river dock. My friend here is in bad shape. Could we cut in front? Don't have time for this bullshit. My friend here, she's in real sorry shape. You couldn't let us cut in front just this once. Uh, uh, she's faking. Of course. Honey, pick my guest. Well, now, hold on. Hold on a sec. Didn't seem so bad just a minute ago. She's a toughie. Keeps it inside, mostly. Now try to Come on, let's go. Lips of yours. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. How about now? Do we? Is it done? Wait, good. Something's wrong. Force Can't open. We don't want to force it open. We'll probably get into a fight, right? So find a way into. Oh, wait a minute. Ah. Don't worry. You're going in. That's one way in, I guess. Wait a minute. Did she just go through the door? Wait a minute. I had to go through the window. She went through the door. What the fuck? The door wouldn't open for me. <laughs> what is going on? She just walked her walk, woogie right in. Anything else here that I can grab? What's this? I don't know. There's all the data packs. I just always grab them. Whoa. What the fuck? This 
stuff on the floor. Okay. I thought I saw a weapon or something in here. What is that? Cotton mouth? It's a gun? That's a gun? No, that's a cane. That's not a gun. <laughs> and an icon like a gun, I guess because... Uh, oh, perfume. Oh, boy. I guess because... Um, every weapon is classified as the same thing in this. What is that? Another door. Oh, my God. What is this? <laughs> well, I got... No, I don't, oh, I don't want to do this. I wanted to grab the item on the floor. The, uh, the weapon is really good. Oh, yeah. The cotton mouth. What happened to my hair? What the fuck? Dude, my hair's gone. Why is my hair missing? I have no idea. My hair's disappeared off my head for no reason. I didn't get a haircut. Figure that one out. I have no idea. <laughs> Can't open that, no. Yeah, so I got a I got a weapon called a cotton mouth. Yeah, it does three hundred twelve damage per second. Poison chance, shock chance, electrical and chemical damage. Okay, I'll have to give it a shot at some point. Stole this fucking weapon. A drip coffee maker? Just go into these rooms, just take every possible item. Completely ripping off whoever you're, you're talking to. It's ridiculous. What can I do for you? Alright. Well, I robbed your whole place. Can we talk? Need a minute of your time. A minute? That's all? <laughs> Shame. You could watch those juicy lips of yours flap for hours, days. Uh, but I'm busy right now. What the fuck is he doing? He's washing you his hands. tiger claws? As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the mock. You, he's the real mocks? skinny. What is he, like a meth head or some Why shit? Why did you say so? So, what brings you here? You install faulty implants. These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. <laughs> See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> you're a sick fuck. Know that? All right. What do you two want? Uh, looking for Evelyn Parker. Evelyn Here we Parker. Go. I need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Shout out to Kenshi552. To me, four dollars. Thank you, Kenshi, so for the four dollar tip. I appreciate that. But let me put it to you this way: I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be. Flattered, praised, patted, to feel like, like they deserve it. Of course, I can't remember each and every one. Please set your exquisite derrieres down. <laughs> uh, where? Huh? Sit, check your logs, sit, start talking, or I'll have to do Mox deal with you. Said the name Forrest set off any buzzers. Punch. Better start remembering or else. Focus V. Forrest. Name mean anything to you? Nope. They call him Woodman. Works at the dollhouse. You... You talk to him? Oh yeah, I talk to him alright. Woodman's got nothing left to say. Didn't like Woodman's tone. <laughs> So I made sure you'll have a tough time speaking for a while. Not too fond of you either right about now. So careful what you say. Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. Oh, he's actually going to tell us now. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. What was wrong with her? You mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what exactly? 
If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Nothing. Any idea what caused the damage? Tech was top-notch. Didn't go kerplunk on its own, that's for sure. Saying she was targeted? A netrunner, as I see it. One with some serious code up their sleeve, too. Hmm. Okay. Get to the point. <clears throat> Point. Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible uh, to have a conversation with her around. What? Don't talk to her that way. Don't talk to her like that. She insulted me! Look, the quicker you spill, the shorter you'll have to put up with us. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? Could very well be on her way to becoming the next underground brain dance, darling. That's all I know. Underground BDs? What do you mean by underground? I don't know. I mean, I don't watch that sort of stuff. Yeah, right. Snuff? XBDs? I told you I don't know. Uh, where are these BDs recording? Where will we find her? How many times do I have to repeat myself? I, I don't know. I I did what anyone in my place would do. When I realized I wouldn't be able to help her, patch her up, I called my fixer. Two guys came and picked her up the same day. Where'd they take her? Where did they take her? I told you already. I don't know. They weren't the talkative kind, and I'm no gunk. I know better than to ask questions of people like that. You're no gunk? What do you think? Why'd all these girls come in here, let you grope around them? Think it's for your <sighs> charm, your caring attitude? They do it because they got no choice. And in the end, they despise you. They can smell you pathetic. The two that came for her. Didn't say anything about where they were going to take her, what they were going to do to her. <clears throat> Mentioned something about virtues with a moth, of all things. Oh? Said she'd be perfect for them, whatever that means. A moth? But that's really all I know. You ponder off like she was some fucking inanimate mannequin. Because that's exactly what she was. <laughs> Damn, she scratched him. I'll be outside. All right. Well, we can do a few shout outs here. Ronald Reagan, war veteran, did two cheers for you. He said, Whose launch was worse, this or No Man's Sky? Well, this game is a game that is just not very functional, has a lot of issues. No Man's Sky was just a bad game. So I would say No Man's Sky was worse. He likes the, the emoticons that we have. Yes, we have many, many different, uh, you know, uh, emotes here in the stream. Thank you. Uh, CM Fool to me, Dollar Three says, true netrunners are like agents from the Matrix. Oh, yeah. So they totally use this hacking and everything to a new level. Maybe that's kind of like the dude, the psycho, who was dodging all my bullets, right? Uh. I don't know. She, uh, <clears throat> overdid it a bit. Temper's been running high lately. Yes, well, you're a far more reasonable beast. Handsomer, too. Amazing. Now I beat him a with his own respect. cane. I destroy him with this cane. I just beat his head in. <laughs> Alright, now we put this away. Okay. Talk to Judy. She's outside. I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Huh. Don't worry, we'll find her. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey, keep it together. You want to give up now? No. Only Lee we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. 
Better than nothing we do. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's head. Heard that term used ever? Death's head symbol bring anything to mind? Mm. Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Hmm. All right, we need to find out where they... We need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Okay. Everyone, everything leaves a trace behind. Everyone, everything leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City. A domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. <clears throat> Might stumble on something useful. Okay. You gonna tell us where it is? <laughs> Let me I think. Gonna walk really slow. I guess she's gonna walk really slow. Hold on one second, guys, because I want to unplug my ear now. My ear's not been plugged for half an hour with this medicine. I just want to unplug it quick. Give me a second. Urgh. V, get it together. There we go. Stupid fucking ear infection. All right. Oh. <clears throat> All right. I know a local fixer. Let's give the dark net site a shot. Let's do that. Dark net domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. Okay. I'll wait in the van. Ask around on XBDs on Jig Jig Street or locate a terminal and find the pleasures of NC Domain. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, excuse me. It's disgusting. Oh. <laughs> hey, yo, man, you trying to rip us off? I got four bags missing here. That's the cut I got off Pablo. Don't like it? Take it up with him. I ain't dealing with Pablo. I'm dealing with you. That means you and the me terminal I can problem. use? Is that what these are? I thought these were people now, you could I talk could to. Now, I could sidewalk with your guts, but that wouldn't get No, it's just all. different terminals. Oh, you wanna try? I don't know who else we could talk to. I need a nap. Just a short one. Do I know you? No. I don't know who you would talk to about this. I think you just, I just used the data terminal. A... Okay. You, uh, want something, Gain access to the domain's underground twin? What? How the fuck do I do that? How do I do that? What the fuck am I supposed to do here? I'm completely confused. Have been just a bit more careful. But I was, and I got a. What the fuck? Out, a phone's you know? floating. Look. Look at that. Nice. If anyone wanted to see a jelly roll, they'd sit at home and look in the mirror. I'm sure. Don't got the eddies to fix you up. Stop whiffing for a week. You'll have plenty. And if I don't work, we're both going hungry. <laughs> what are they talking about? No bar or something. Go get yourself fixed up. I don't know what to do. I'm stuck. I don't know how to gain access to what they're talking about. Oh, what's this? Okay, can I talk to this person? No. No. Even though there's a fucking... Quite a, a, a investigation thing on top of that. Oh! Her implants are older than I am. I can't believe she finds the spares to keep them running. Can't talk to her? No. <laughs> Do 
New face? You're not from round here. I don't know what to do. I'm lost right now. The game is telling me to do something that you can't do on the terminal. And they're telling me to talk to people about who? Raw. Untouched. Raw's all you get with me. What's your edge? <laughs> the time. They turned towards me. That was funny. How about you? You buying or just gonna stand there like a pig undercover? I need a special brain dance. Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? Why don't they come with the death's head badge? Give me the best of the best. The ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. No discount? How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. What a dick. Well, browse items. Got anything that might interest me? Uh... Ritual Bowl Vinyl Record. Deep Fried Death's Head Moth. That's what I need. Right? That's exactly what I need. Legendary. It's a thousand. I have enough. There we go. Pleasure doing biz with you. So you, I bought it. That was what I needed. You need to have a thousand and then you just do the mission. Okay. Alright, here's Judy's van. Have I seen Tombstone? I don't know what you mean by that. Jack's party, I don't know what you mean by that. Is it a movie or something? Um, CM Fool to me, $1.30s is the very bottom of the terminal. Oh, I'm already done with that. I bought it from the guy, so I guess I'm done. I don't need to do that anymore. And Duke Argos. Cheery says, apparently Sony's being generous with refunds in the game. If you ask them, it's not too late. Yeah, well, on PS4. That's what I've heard. On PS4, you get a refund. The Columbus Sea Dragon. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. They all want to. Okay. I'm ready when you are. So we're gonna do a brain dance in the van. Okay. By the way, they patched the game to fix this. See? Yeah, look. There's no more epileptic seizure inducing flash. They fixed it. They changed the uh they changed the way that, that the brain dance happened so that people wouldn't get wouldn't have that stuff set off anymore. So what the fuck is this? Look at this. What the hell? This one's gonna be creepy to analyze, man. on so you can't see them. Whoa, what the hell? What are they hacker? Whoa! Oh my god, what? What the fuck? called a disaster piece. Well then. I guess we gotta rewind. What are we looking for here? Exactly. I can't switch? I thought there were ways to switch between the audio feed. Or the speeds, I guess not. Oh, there's an editing mode for that, right? Here we go. Around all you want. Scab woman. 
Who knew that sides chopping people up they were scrolling XBDs? Standard for a trashy. Can beat that rich synth guy for room. Paper cup. Cheap shit. Cold too. Mm hmm. Buck a slice. Scav. Scavengers. Netrunner, no affiliation. Status alive at this point, anyway. Gotta look around for things that we can identify. Remember, it's visual and there's also audio. There's different things you can do. Oh! There's someone else in the background. Electric corp patch in the coveralls. Ah. Electric corp. Okay. What was that? I saw something over here. Thought I did. Maybe not. This guy. Scav. Gotta be. No one else with that kind of fashion sense. Okay. Jethro's main cheers. I figured you know that Tombstone is a movie. Don't you watch a lot of movies since you leave the house once every three years? I don't know if I've ever seen Tombstone. Whoa. What's that? Well, that's got to be something. All right, let's keep our eyes peeled here. There's probably going to be more stuff back here. Aha! What is that? Slice of Ordered pizza? <laughs> A fucking slice of pizza. Coffee was cold. Like, from the day before. Pizza looked fresh, though. Huh. So? Means someone's grabbing bucket slice regularly. Which is not something someone does for the flavor and the fresh ingredients. Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna slap across town for it. Okay. We're looking for an electric core power plant located near a bucket slice. Ah. Uh -huh. BC used to have a big old complex in Charter Hill. Bucket slice checks out too. How can you be sure though? Okay. That's it. Exit the brain dance when ready. We did it. Just by looking around, we already figured it out. Okay. Here we go. Old electric core power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with this for now. Nothing else to garner from this scroll. Huh. That was way easier than the last one. The last one that we did was more complicated. Okay. Alrighty then. Ten minutes left on the stream. I don't think we're gonna have much time to do uh, any more story. We did advance the story significantly today though. No time to lose. We gotta go there. No, my friends. Definitely. Ride with me. Level up. But don't take it from me. Get out there and enjoy the sun. Let's say sure. Let's get going. Go right there. Way. Might as well. And I can level up. So what do I want to level up here? I hit level five with this. I guess I want to up my intelligence now. And then what do I want to put the perk point into? Who fucking knows? Oops. <laughs> Screwed that up. Increase the amount of Euro dollars by 50% that you get from access points. Fuck it, just do it. When I hack, I make 50% more money. Okay. Good enough. <clears throat> Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the dead's head moth. All this scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. There'd have to be other gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. Okay. That's what she's saying. Is that they wouldn't put her in a snuff film or anything because she's too valuable. They would have her do other shit, you know. Be more, much more valuable to them, you know, making big use. What is this? Why are we fucking driving through the city? I guess it's just supposed to be like an intermission. If you want to take a break or whatever. Here, we can skip the ride. There, I skipped it. 
rather than sitting in the car the whole time. Okay. My city centipede. What the fuck? All right, I'm not getting out. In. Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet, see if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. Okay. Ju oh, there we go. All right, going in. So I gotta find a way in, huh? I have technical ability to open it. I started with the car, but it didn't really help. Or somehow they got alerted. It makes no sense. Okay, I guess I got killed. Heard shots. You still alive? I'm here. Got no time to creep around. I'm about to die. I can't move. <laughs> I can't even do anything. I have no idea why they were alerted. I wasn't in their line of sight. I did nothing to alert them, and they all knew I was there. Yeah, this gameplay is fucking terrible. It really is. Like, I'm telling you, the story is interesting and the gameplay mechanics are fucking trash. Like, look, I'm not in anyone's line of sight for them to hack me, but I'm getting hacked. Basically, just a first person shooter at this point. Die, die, die. There's no point in playing it any other way. Got the blueprint. Be there. Try to find a way to there. Amazing. This is so dumb. You're getting hacked by people. They're not in your line of sight. They don't even know you're there. Like, what? Now I'm getting shot by someone across the room. I can't even move. I'm stuck. I can't move again. I can't look. <laughs> Overheated by who? There's no one here. I don't. What is going on? Find a way to the sub levels. Uh, what? This door doesn't even activate. Look at this. Uh... I'm 
amazing. I, I don't know why. It's still acting like there's enemies here. I don't know why, because there are none. I guess the sub levels are over here, but I killed everyone in the room. <laughs> this game doesn't make any sense at all. I really didn't want to go in guns blazing like this, but there was no other way to do the mission because it didn't work. I was trying to be stealthy, so the game's like, nope. Everyone just detects you for no reason. Okay, well, I, I guess I'll just kill everybody. Where? Jack in, try to get extra points by hacking. No, it didn't work. Oh, here we go. It was tap instead of hold. So I can't do so one C one C E nine fifty five one C. So here it is. One C one C E9, but it failed the other one. I don't get it. The demons have been uploaded. <laughs> this is just... It, this is a convoluted mess is what it is. It's a convoluted mess. I tried to hack, and the hacking, I was trying to distract them with the camera. As I was doing it, all of a sudden, they just were all alerted to my presence and started firing guns. And it's like, what's the point of the hacking at all? And then when I used the guns, I just murdered them all easily, so it made more sense to just use the guns. I didn't need this stealth was completely worthless. Alright, anyway. Yeah, I got a bunch of new new guns, I guess. Shut up. Just a camera. <laughs> I just find it odd that they're like, oh, you could use stealth, you could use hacking. He's like, yeah, they're worthless. Like, there's no point in using either of them. Because you could just run right in and just kill everything easily. You're actually giving yourself a harder time trying to use those things because they don't effectively work right. They just don't. I'm sorry. I was hacking and I was trying to distract. The next thing you know, they're all, every enemy is alerted and comes after me. I'm like, what? For what? Why? Nothing happened. I haven't made a noise. it there was one item in here that was it oh man anyway so i gotta get to the sub levels found a way down you see my position yep be there in a sec wait for me see them up ahead a cell here. we need to get to level minus two Bet that's where they're keeping her. Here she is. All right. That shirt. I know it. Whoa. <laughs> Damn. This guy got fucked. He just tossed his body here. Maybe this opens later. Right now it does nothing. Okay. All right. So this is where we'll leave it. Let me save. Okay. And next time around we'll continue from here. Um... You know, major story mission. Will we find Evelyn? I don't know. I don't know what we're going to find. Uh, a few more tips came in. See him full to the doctor. He said the camera has an ability to ping so the enemy can see you through walls. So you're saying they hacked the camera, used the camera to see me. This is so weird. Uh, throw 
throw Thok tipped me a dollar thirty and said the detractors are obsessed here something to trigger the losers. <laughs> all right. And CM Full to me another dollar thirty says you need to upgrade your deck to get all three. Your buffer is at four. You need at least six to get all three. You're, I mean, you're right. I only have the base four. I never did an upgrade to get more hacking ability. Um, all right, anyway. It is what it is. Thank you, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the stream regardless. You know, we had two crashes, and we had some issues, but it just seems to me that rushing in and shooting everything is easier in the game than anything else, which makes it a first-person shooter, right? It doesn't really make it much of an RPG. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. I'm going to upload this gameplay right now. Until next time, which will be tomorrow at some point. I just don't know when yet. Uh, what I would say is give me your feedback. Do you want this as the mainstream tomorrow, or do you want it as the night stream? Okay, let me know. Thanks.